In this paper we'll propose our dense noise-aware SLAM, DNA SLAM, for time-of-flight RGBD cameras. Dense methods using all depth and intensity information for camera motion estimation showed best results in the past. However, usually they were developed and evaluated with RGBD cameras using pattern projection, for example the Kinect V1. Recently, time-of-flight cameras like the Kinect V2 were released, promising higher quality. While the overall accuracy increases for these time-of-flight cameras, a new noise characteristic was introduced. Recent RGBD SLAM approaches use a dense motion estimation under the assumption of photometric and geometric consistency. This means neither the scene color nor the scene geometry changes between two RGBD images. To verify this assumption, we placed a pattern protection camera, the Kinect V1, and a time of light camera, the Kinect V2, in front of an office scene on a tripod and captured two subsequent RGBD images. Ideally, the two consecutive images should not contain any differences in intensity and depth. As visible in the images below, the intensity does not change over time for both cameras. Next, we have a look on the captured depth images. The depth images of the pattern projection camera disclose only for some rare pixels bigger differences in depth. However, the time of light camera discloses violations of the geometric consistency assumption for numerous pixels. These violations will lead to inaccuracies in the dense motion estimation unless they are not especially treated. Thus, we propose a new sophisticated weighting scheme that incorporates the reliability of pixels. We detected that the local depth derivatives coincide with the violations of time of light cameras. This means time of light pixels with a high depth derivative are likely to violate the consistency assumption, whereas pixels with a low depth derivative can be considered as reliable. The local depth derivatives are a good reliability measurement because of the noise characteristics of time of light cameras. Time of light cameras exhibit a high frequent per pixel noise as shown on the right. This means in case of imprecise measurements the depth values of neighboring pixels strongly differ. In contrast pattern projection cameras exhibit their noise as a patch noise or distortions over the surface. Thus local depth derivatives are a good quality measurement for time of light cameras but not for pattern projection cameras. We compute for each single pixel in the RGBD frames an individual weight according to its reliability. In this figure, red pixels have a high reliability, leading to a high weight, whereas blue pixels are not reliable. It is clearly visible where pixels are downweighted. For example, on the glossy floor, close to edges, or in the image corners. The sophisticated weighting leads to significantly increased accuracy. This figure gives a visual impression of the estimated trajectories. Ground truth trajectories are shown in blue, the state-of-the-art algorithm DVO is shown in red and our DNA SLAM is shown in yellow. In all sequences DNA SLAM is closer to the ground truth than DVO. Next we have a look on the resulting maps. DVO on the left incorporates some inaccuracies, whereas DNA SLAM on the right demonstrates its high accuracy. Similar results are also achieved for other sequences as shown in the paper. Summarized, we can conclude that our new weighting scheme substantially reduces the drift in dense motion estimation with time-of-flight cameras.